you needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, we got a Color Smash LTD. Now, I'll probably be opening up a few packs to try to get this LTD today because I am pretty excited. If I, I haven't pulled an LTD all year, and of course, guys, it would be me to pull one of the bad LTDs. Because as you do know, these LTDs that come with the Color Smash promo are like limited, like reduced LTDs. They're not like 98 overalls or 97. There's 96s, which would still be a great pull. Don't get me wrong, but it would not by any means by any means be what I was expecting. But guys, could we pull our first LTD today? We're gonna try a little bit. We're not gonna go crazy, obviously. We're gonna try a little bit, test the waters out with him. But, guys, our first Color Smash LTD. We didn't get any kind of like, pro. we haven't gotten a promo LTD like this in a little bit. Although it's not great, the card itself is great. The card itself is still really good, but in like the last promo, we didn't get a, we've been waiting for surprise LTDs. We haven't really been getting them. It's about time we did get them. I'm excited. I'm gonna try a little bit and go over stats. Obviously, once it's on the block, it could take a while, as you guys do know. But guys, before we get into today's video and try to open some of these, make sure you're gonna blow, hit that subscribe button, turn the notification boys, come join the family. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up as always, and comment down below if you guys need any help with anything. Guys, as far as the LTD goes, you guys, it's Darius Slay. You can probably see by the title at this point. You guys know Darius Slay moved to a new team, hasn't really gotten a card, so we were expecting him to get a color smash card. We've been expecting that. If I did pull, it probably only go for like 400 to 5, 400k at max, mm, 4 300k, and he quick sells for 260, which isn't bad. Not a crazy amount of coins, but it would be nice if we could actually pull some. Have still our limited time marker for the year is zero. No joke, guys. Next, I'm literally gonna keep a list of all my pulls for the year. I'm gonna put on the screen LTD marker zero because we, we've got a bad LTD year. I mean, we've never had an LTD, but this one was worse because I actually wanted to get one this year. Like usually, I don't add open packs. This year opened a little bit, so I was kind of expecting something. But next year's gonna be our year. We're gonna get one next year. But let's get into this. Let's go over, check if he's on the block, and then start ripping packs. I just want to go over some of the color smash player awards that you can be getting from doing the brand new house rules. And I didn't really want to go over the house rules because we went over this already before. You guys already know how played out works. Offensive and all defensive plays go on cooldown for five plays. You can only use it once, and then it goes on cooldown for five plays. And then if you use it again, you can't use it the rest, I believe, of the game. You gotta be mixing up with a ton of plays, guys. You can't just be spamming plays. Which can be annoying for some people. 25 total wins get you a 91 to 95. And all the other ones get you 87 to 95. So you have the chance to get anywhere between 87 to 95 every single every five wins. And potentially if you get all 95s, which is very highly unlikely. Could be really, really good, guys. But you get two, 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 three, two. So that's two, four, six, nine, eleven. Eleven, nine, uh, 87 to 95 overall players, guys. This could be super, super good, guys. But that's about it, guys. Let me get back to the rest of the card content. Let's go check if he's on the auction block, and if he is not already, we're going to go right into some of our packs, see if we have a chance of pulling Darius Slay. I wish they made him higher overall. I don't know why they'd make LTDs that weren't one of the highest overalls in the promo. So it's like, oh wow, I pulled one of the rarest things in Madden, but at the same time, it's really not all that rare right now. So, kind of sucks that that's the way they did it, but you got to take the good with the bad as per usual. So, let's go check my Eagles, and let's go filter out, and let's go, let's go by Color Smash, actually. So we can filter out everything. I don't believe he is up yet. It does not appear that he is going to be up just yet. I mean, it's only been it's only been four minutes, so not surprised in the slightest. But we gotta get to ripping. We need a chance to pull this dairy. So let's go over to the bottom, make it a little bit easier on ourselves. Thielen, obviously, he has been out, but the new one is going to be Darius Slay. So let's go open some packs. Let's see if we could possibly pull now. What what should we rip right about now? I'm feeling some get a golds because honestly, nothing else really hits for me at the most part. 187 plus color smash player. No, I, I just don't trust those. I, I don't trust those at all. Get a golds. I haven't really gotten much all year out of them, but I get to open a little bit more packs, which I can't really say the same for those. Do I have any of those little money packs waiting around for me that I can just open up and get like a guaranteed plus player? I thought I did. Guess not. Just an 87. Okay. Oh, I got a 91 plus. I'll be right back. We're going to open this. We're going to open this one. Okay, so I picked them up points. Don't kill me. It's $1.50. If there was ever a chance of us getting it, it would be out of this pack. So let's rip this one wide open. I don't know what an LTD pool even looks like. Mm, we get 93 Brandon Linder. Not horrible. Honestly, not a bad return because I could probably get some decent coins back off that. But still, that was our best shot of getting him. But don't worry, we still got to get a gold. And we got this 97 Ultimate Legend pack that I'm still saving for a while. I don't know when I plan to actually go ahead and buy that thing. Let's get into some of the get a gold. See if we can pull before we go over all the stats. 
Uh, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to go with the Yep, get a gold times five open one of these bundles up if it goes well open up another if it does not Just go back and look at some of the stats. So let's see. We got a legend pull right here. We got 86 short and gross. Okay Sad part is that it's probably did I make my coins back? That's probably only like what like 10k. All right. It's not bad. I'll take that I'll take that. I always got to go back after this and obviously look at everything. A Mud Heroes card. I've been getting a lot of Mud Heroes cards lately, guys. If you guys haven't been watching the channel. Twitch packs, scream. They just send out Mud Hero cards. I've been getting a lot of them. But let's get into the next uh, play right here. Another gold. Not bad, though, because the first two kind of made up for it. If I could sell the first two for at least 20k, I'll probably rip another one of these. All right, let's see what we got here. An Abase Elite, and we get Kyle Fuller 83. Okay, these have not been so bad. Pull rates must be up on these because these, these are going way better than usual. Now, I'm kind of surprised here. And a gold. Okay, that one wasn't great. So, let's just check the price real quick. And if that's all checks out, we will be going into another one. Or we're just going to go check out the stats. It all depends on the pricing. Because we can't be, we have to save coins for golden tickets, as you guys know. It's very, very soon. Cannot be wasting my coins when it comes to golden tickets. Definitely want to pick up some for the channel so you guys can check them out. So, Kyle Fuller. You guys, only goes for 16k. Kind of lost a little bit there. Not that I really care too much. But we're going to go into the stats because for the most part can't be wasting too many coins i tried my luck there just a quick little five and a 91 plus not a lot but i feel like if i keep just doing little ounces of attempts eventually i gotta be blessed with one that's not so much in my personal opinion or unless there's some methods of the madness that you have to actually go ahead and do all of them and you have to just spam packs in order to actually have a chance at getting it i don't know if that's how mad encodes it or that's like a thing i do know that i never get them and i only do short amount of bursts of players Darius Slate is on the block, as you guys see. Wow, quite a lot of them pulled. Clearly, I didn't pull one. Let's go check them out. Really cool looking card art for the most part, not gonna lie. But Darius Slate Jr., 96 overall, 6 feet tall, 95 speed, 94 acceleration, 94 agility, 90 jumping, 95 play rec, 91 man, 97 zone, 92 press. So, first takeaway can be powered up, obviously. So, his speed does get to about a 99. So, solid speed. Excel is pretty decent, honestly. Thought it should have been a little bit higher. Agility solid. Gonna get that thing to like a 96, 97. Jumping's a little bit low, but we can deal with that. Play rec's going to be a 99 powered up with lockdown and John Madden pass defense. Zone is a 99. Man coverage only gets like a 95, and press will get to about a 95, 96. So this card overall is pretty good. It is a 96. Remember, when you look at this card, you can't base it off like what a new card should look like, because technically you were going back in time with this one. It does quick sell for 260,000 coins, which isn't bad. Let's see what his catching is. Catching to 73. Let's compare him to a cornerback that we have. So, Deion Sanders. Obviously, Deion's going to destroy him. Deion destroys every single cornerback in most things other than uh, physicality. So, let's compare him to Denzel Ward. A slightly more comparable. Okay, if we power up Darius Slay, Ward's faster. Better excel. Better agility. Better jumping. Less play rec. Better man. Wait, okay, so their man and zone kind of flip. And the press better. So, Denzel Ward's better in my opinion. But coverage-wise, Slay is probably the slightest edge. Ever so slightly. But still next nitrate lane 96 overall wow he's actually way better than nitrate lane 96 but yeah this nitrate lane was always it was always unathletic for the most part compared to what he is with the, compared to right now for his time he was decent but yeah once i toss that new one in he's gonna probably blow away most people it is kind of funny how they make him kind of slower because he is like super athletic but yeah this Darius Slay actually kills uh kills that nitrate lane that's, that's impressive at the same exact overall but the, i mean the next one obviously takes the cake but still wow this night is not 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 that great anymore now looking at it why am i back why am i backing out of him all right so next time i have another comparison oh mel blunt uh yeah blows away mel blunt for the most part athleticism wise play rec zone and it's not like he has a man that matches it and that's pretty much yeah i can't I'm compared to 89 byron jones guys Darius slice pretty good whatever i can be picking him up probably not like i said he's gonna be in like the 400k high 300k range uh, i don't think he's worth it i think you're much better off getting just like some ultimate legend cornerback like wait for one of those or just wait for some other new cards because i don't think he's worth 331 well, he went down pretty fast 331k even then i still don't think he's worth it because you can get a, you can get any top cornerback in the game for that price minus nitro and lane but guys this is better for the video hope you guys enjoyed this video if you're new to the channel make sure you go down below hit that subscribe button turn that on to go boys come join the family make sure you give this video a big thumbs up as always i greatly appreciate you guys who still come out each and every day to still show support in these uh you know these rough times and these uh, later times of Madden, hopefully Golden Tickets ignites a spark back in Madden. We can only hope so, at least, guys. But hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Make sure to check out my other video going over some of the Golden Ticket stuff. Because Golden Tickets are coming out, as you guys know, in two days, Thursday. Will we be trying to pull one? I don't know just yet. Because quite honestly, I think I'll be better off just buying one. 
but I do because I, I don't have a lot of coins and obviously I'm gonna need a lot of coins to do most of this but this has been it for the video guys hope you guys did enjoy if you're new to the channel like I said subscribe thank you guys for watching enjoy the rest of your day make sure to check out today's other video and comment down below if you need any help with anything or hit me up on Twitter thank you guys for watching I'm out peace